What's up guys? So I'm going to be telling you how to fix FIFA 23 not launching, crashing, freezing and black screen issues on PC super easily and fast. But real quick, I would like to let you guys know that I am going to be giving away a ton of FIFA point codes for you guys. So if you would like the chance to get some free FIFA points, then all you've got to do is just drop a like on today's video and subscribe to the channel with the post notification bell turned on. Once you've done that, comment down below what platform you play on so I can hook you guys up with some free FIFA point codes. But now let's go ahead and get into how to fix FIFA 23 not launching, crashing, freezing and black screen issues on PC the easiest and the fastest way possible. So what you do want to go ahead and basically do guys in order to get started to fix all of these issues on FIFA 23 literally everything in this title in this video is going to be included of how to fix so this is how we're going to fix all of these issues with it not launching with it crashing constantly with it freezing and like all the black screen issues on PC and all of these issues are in one big solution So what you guys do want to do is just make your way onto your PC home screen just where I am right here right now so just go ahead and basically make your way onto your pc home screen i'm assuming you will have fifa 23 installed guys exactly like i do so you just want to go ahead and drag your fifa 23 just so you can see it in the center guys it will make this whole process easier and obviously you can drag it back to a normal place obviously later on so once you've got fifa 23 you can see it on your menu guys and obviously you are actually in your pc menu so the first thing you need to do if you're actually experience either your game not launching crashing freezing and like the black screen issues you need to restart your game first of all so just make sure you restart your game if you've already done that um and you're looking for a solution you need to go ahead restart your pc and obviously launch the game so you need to make sure you can also do that now, if none of them things work by restarting the game or restarting your PC and launching the game back up, this is what you are going to want to go ahead and do, guys. This is a 100% guaranteed fix. So this is what we're going to do. So you want to right-click on your FIFA 23. You're going to see all these different options, right? You're going to see open, open file location. Like, you're going to see run as administrator, basically all these different options. So what we are going to want to do, guys, is we're going to go ahead and basically run our FIFA 23 as an administrator. So just go ahead and click run as administrator, press yes, and then just make sure, guys, that you've run that as an administrator. So once you've done that, that is a step you can do. Then it's going to load up um, Origin. It's going to say connect into Origin, and then once it does say that, then you know that you have run it as an administrator and then it will try to start but you don't need to start it just yet because there's still a couple of other things you can do so the next thing which you guys can actually go ahead and do guys is you can go ahead and yeah as you can see so fifa's launched so that is enough way you can fix it but another thing you can go ahead and basically do guys to actually fix all of these issues in one go like obviously in not launching the crashing issues the freezing and black screen issues and stuff like that so another issue which you guys can do is if you're using the ea app or the origin app so obviously you know there's two different apps right so there's this origin app right here and there's an ea app they're two separate things but they're kind of linked uninstall one or the other and just stick to one if it's not working on origin launch the game through the ea app if it's not working on if it's not working on the ea app launch it through origin as well guys um so there's some more steps you guys can do in order to go ahead and basically make sure that this works fifa 23 so another one you can do is uninstall fifa 23 and reinstall it i know that takes long but if you think about it in the long run it's just going to help you out a ton more if you just uninstall it and reinstall it which will honestly be super like more easy basically um another thing you can do is update windows 10 or 11 so you can do that by pressing the windows button going into settings going into um so you, once you basically went ahead and gone in settings you want to go to update and security once you've gone to that 
you need to make sure that you've actually checked for updates on windows 10 or 11 and make sure you actually follow all of these steps because it will should 100 percent work um and if windows 10 ain't working maybe just try out windows 11 or if windows 11 ain't working go back to windows 10 and then another thing which you can go ahead and basically do is um uninstall and reinstall your graphics driver there's videos how to do that it can work on any graphics driver um as well as that um there's another step you can launch the game in windowed mode and lower your graphics settings you guys just need to go in the settings once you're in fifa 23 it should say like video and then you just lower your graphics settings which i know could be annoying because you want to plan high graphics but it should fix it for the time being um and as well, you can uninstall and delete the game folder and then reinstall the game to a different drive. So say if, for example, on your PC, you've, it's in, I don't know, your D drive, you can move it to your C drive. And then that also works. That Because I was getting all of these issues. I was literally getting FIFA 23 not launching and crashing as well as freezing and the black screen. I was getting all of them guys on, on my PC. So it's literally working for me now because I literally... Um, done all of these steps which i'm telling you right now which is like literally the best thing i would say and then guys there's a few more steps that i've only told you like 90 percent of it there's a few more steps what you guys can do um if you actually do go ahead guys um, and disable in-game overlay in origin or steam and close other overlay applications so basically any overlay um in your origin or settings you need to turn basically off which is a really really useful step um and also guys another step which you guys can actually go ahead and basically do is you can actually go ahead so this is really really simple guys and really really easy the final step which you guys can do is like say if you have an antivirus or anything sometimes your antivirus can stop it doing it so if you have an antivirus maybe just make the antivirus um settings actually less um what is it called make the antivirus settings less harsh um so then your fifa 23 should work and once you've done all those steps combined it should fix all of those issues in one go literally my mates have tried it 100 percent worked for them it worked for me it's honestly a game changer so guys that will fix it that will fix FIFA 23 not launching, the crashes, freezing problems, and black screens. So hopefully you did find this useful, and that is the 100% fix. Yeah, guys, that's basically the video. Make sure you share the video with everyone you know. Go down below, drop a like, and subscribe with all notifications turned on, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.